Well, people living right next to Camp Pendleton say the traffic at the last intersection before the base is so bad they can't leave their neighborhood at times. Our Kasha Gorgorchik joins us live in Oceanside tonight to explain the situation. Kasha. Hey, Andrew, and yeah, we are here at the intersection of Harbor Drive and San Rafael. An entire residential community is situated just south of the base here, and they say this street is their only way out. What if an emergency was happening? This is our only way out of the neighborhood. Residents living in Oceanside's Capistrano Park neighborhood nestled right next to Camp Pendleton say rush hour traffic makes it extremely difficult to exit their community. Constantly blocking the intersection, can't even go on a green light, having to wait for another cycle. The backup to get on base extends far down Harbor Drive, even onto the freeway, and those residents waiting to turn out from San Rafael Drive are often blocked in. Three days ago, as uh, someone got T-boned, so it's accidents are now happening. They've been happening. While there is only one way out, there are two ways into the neighborhood. Sammy Lennox lives on Capistrano Drive, where no left turn signs have been posted during morning hours to stop people from using the neighborhood as a shortcut. Lennox asked Oceanside police to patrol the illegal left turns just recently. They came out and they did probably two weeks in a row. They did random checks here. I have never seen anybody get a ticket for blocking this intersection. I've never seen anybody enforcing it. But when it comes to the problem intersection, it seems several jurisdictions are at play. Oceanside police and CHP both confirm they're responsible for portions of the area and Marine Corps law enforcement is also nearby. Having a police presence I think would make a huge difference in actually giving people tickets for breaking the law so they don't do it again, you know, because then they know, oh, they're actually cracking down on this now. Many people living in Capistrano Park say they respect their neighbors, but just want the area safe and accessible for everyone. Most people in this neighborhood either have family members that have served, they've served themselves, or they go to school with people who serve. And so we understand that it's frustrating for them and they want to get on base. We totally understand that. We also just want to leave our neighborhood safely. And Camp Pendleton says it has not received any official complaints about this intersection, but they did tell me tonight if the surrounding community has concerns, it is certainly something they want to look into. Reporting live in Oceanside tonight, Kasia Grigorczyk, Fox 5 News.